I believe every player lives on a scale, and that scale is mechanic and magician. And there's nothing right or wrong about either, but the mechanic is more of a blue collar reps guy, and the magician is a guy that has magic gold dust that doesn't need as much to feel really good about their game. Pete was a magician. Welcome to Top Court, everybody. I am Paul Anacone, and this is... Taylor Fritz here. I knew he would know that. See how tired you can make him. See how long he can keep going without missing. The most challenging thing is as a player, you feel like you control everything. You can control so much of what you do. And then all of a sudden you have to turn the lens around. When you become a coach, you turn the lens around so that you see it from a different viewpoint and you have to figure out how to manage, teach, adjust, and coach someone and something that you don't fully control. Categorize your misses. Big difference between a good miss and a bad miss. You pick the right shot and you miss it, that's fine, because you're gonna do it enough times where you're not gonna miss it. Understand your game, understand who you are as an athlete, and when you have those two themes, you can then put together the best plan for you to play the tennis that you can play at the highest level. Doesn't matter if it's at Wimbledon, doesn't matter if it's your local racquet club. If you understand who you are as a player and understand who you are as an athlete, that will give you the blueprint to maximize whatever talent you have. I'm Paul Anacone, and welcome to Top Court.